another walk with Anton episode. Come, walk with me. Wow, I just came back from Malaysia, not at the airport. Just arrived at the airport. All right, I want to share with you a little something that's happening to me、uh, during my journey. Because I was in I was in Malaysia doing a little training, see. So I went to this、uh, hotel resort. Is this hotel resort is somewhere nearby the golf course,、uh, nearby JB. So when I was there after the training,、uh, it was a three hours session from starting from seven starting from six thirty until nine thirty. So once the session training session is finished, it's almost reach around like night time, and of course we had to stay back and chit chat a bit with、uh, with the companions over there. So you know, time will running around until ten or ten thirty already. It's getting very late. So once everybody is starting to go back, and I realized that at that particular place, I forgot to. Cash out、uh, extra cash for myself, and also my phone battery is almost running out, so I don't have enough phone batteries to call for uh, uh, grabs. I also don't have enough money in, on on my side. So what should I do? I'm panic, no money and no phone power. So what should I do? Well, I have to sit down quietly and think about hmm. How am I going to solve this situation? I have not enough money on my side, and the time is getting very late. And also, I don't have the phone battery to call for a mini grab car, so I'm on my own. I'm stuck. I'm stuck at this hotel resort. And、uh, the only thing I have to do is、uh, I try to borrow, not to borrow money, ah,、uh, try to borrow some power banks from people. I say that to people, I want to charge a few. Power for my smartphone to have a little energy, so I can、uh, use my phone to contact some、uh, call for a grab car to pick me up.、Uh, I have a lot of companions here, but none of them seems to want to help me. I don't know why. Since we all in the training together, we all make friends. But I I don't blame them. I know that we all met first time. Well, we all met first time. So most of the people they. Have this kind of habit that、uh, they don't want to help a stranger because they don't know they don't know who you are yet. They just met you, and suddenly you want to borrow something from them. You want to take. I even want to ask people ask ask some of them to、uh, give me a ride because some of them drive through the training. You see, some of them drive through there. So I also ask them to whether they can drop me off, drop me off at, at the interchange. But nobody seems to want to do that. Nobody want to pick me up. No one to ride, ride, ride me to the interchange. No one to borrow me power banks. Wow, people are so fascinating, is it? First time met a stranger and nothing want to do with him. So I always take it the positive way. So I say that nobody int- intend to help me. No problem. I walk by my own. I walk by my own from the hotel resort. To I walk my way from the hotel resort. It's almost like a two hundred kilometers of distance, ah,、uh, from the hotel distance. I have to walk out from that particular estate to reach to the town to the town area, which is uh where areas have any banks or ATM machines, so I can cash out some check, ah,、uh, cash out some money to 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 pay for my ride, even when I call a taxi or what. Uh. On my halfway, when I'm walking through the, it, it, the whole the whole distance is around the、like、200 kilometers. But on my personal walk, I almost I only walk around like 30 kilometers, 100 kilometers. Suddenly, the guard, the guard that look after the car park, the guard, ride a motorcycle, come reach for me, behind me. He, I was just walking and walking, and then he just. Uh, ride on his motorcycle and beep beep. He told me that, hey, why are you walking all alone? I told the security guard that, well, uh, I walking all my way to the downtown area. I want to see wherever have any banks or any ATM machines so I can cash out some money so I can take a taxi home. Because、uh, I ask people that if anybody can borrow me a power bank so I can charge my phone, I can call Grab. Nobody want to lend the power bank for me. 
And I also ask for people that can give me a bribe to drop me off for the interchange. Nobody want to do that. So uh, the security guard was very kind enough. Uh, instead of letting, letting me walk all the way by my own, he gave me a ride on his motorcycle and picked me up from the hotel resort, right all the way to the 200, uh, 200 kilometers uh, distance and dropped me off at the interchange. Wow, I'm very pleased to have such helpful people. So, the lesson is here is that whenever you're in doubt, uh, don't, don't, don't give up, uh, just uh, persevere yourself. For me, I just persevere myself, just walking on my own. And suddenly, help was on the way. I was on my own and then help is on the way behind me and then come and pick me up. So, I'm very grateful that I can have such a good helping people surrounding me. Or those are people that really, really, my, really can help but they don't intend to help. But those people that I don't expect to help, they come and help. Whereas uh, the the opposite. No, I, I still, uh, of course I don't blame anybody, I understand. I'm not complaining. I just say that humans are fascinating. They don't like to help strangers and they, of course I don't blame anybody by the, not to help strangers. But when people knew, do need your help, um, try try to understand the people and try to try to understand the person and try to help him. But this is my personal lesson. This is the personal thing I learned. Although nobody want to help me, I help myself. Or I stay positive. But then who knows? Help can some some somewhere help is, help is on their way lah. Like. So is most of you less expected. I didn't call for any help, but the help is just simply there for me anyway uh, okay I just uh, made it back to Singapore and uh, reached the airport so I need to grab a bus and go back go back as soon as possible because it's very late almost in the morning already and sure this is kind of experience I feel I, I was encountered uh, later this evening I was later this evening during my trip in Malaysia very interesting. So, all right, that's all for my little quick sharing here. So, uh, subscribe the channel and see any positive sharing I can make on this short video again. Okay, catch you all later for another episode of uh, Walk with Anton, that positive guy. Catch you. All.